Well, those not battling the virus may be seeing the effect in other ways, from how you get around town to how long trash sits out in front of your yard. Yeah, we are getting a better idea of how COVID is affecting the city services that you rely on. WRG's April Thompson has more on the changes you may start seeing. Caution. Matta putting out an alert for passengers. Expect longer than usual waits for travel. It is even asking those using Matta Plus to temporarily limit travel requests to only necessary trips. The bus service says because of COVID exposures, they just don't have enough staff to work. They aren't the only ones. We have probably hundreds of uh, people off work right now because uh, they have COVID. That was Mayor Jim Strickland on Live at 9 Wednesday. The city of Memphis feeling the impact too. For instance, our fire department had, our fire chief had to cancel vacations this month for, for uh, her firefighters so that every station could be fully uh, manned uh, with personnel. So what can you expect? For garbage pickup, the trash in some areas of town may be sitting a little longer because workers are out sick. So we're asking folks for a little patience, present your can to the curb, and if it's not collected on your day, we will try to be back the very next day to pick that up, but we will come by and get it. We have not forgotten about you. Going to a city community center? All of our community centers are open, but some of the programming that you may be used to where we had open play and you could just show up as a group and play, we're having to restrict that to about 50% capacity. And uh, we're asking that you go to the Memphis, Memphis Parks website to sign up for a slot so that we know we have staff there to help you. And while libraries are still open, group meetings have been suspended until the city has sufficient staff. April Thompson, WREG News Channel 3. The city's 311 services where you call to report problems is affected as well. In fact, it usually has 12 to 13 people staffing phones, but the city says it is down to five people right now this week because of COVID.